Well, the first corner, um, very interesting braking there. I think it'll be very late braking. It's very uphill. Uh, you know, when you when you get out of last corner, you get down there and you see a wall in front of you. Uh, it's, it's quite an impression. Um, after that, it's it's a blind exit. So that will be interesting as well. You know, there's time to be gained there. And then you get in that part of the track, which is the fastest. So give me a right ender that should be quite flat with a Formula One car. And then these S's that. Uh, very similar to the Beckett SS in, uh, in Silverstone. Um, that should be really good fun as well, you know. First one should enter flat and a downship for each SS, so uh, last one being in third gear probably. Um, a bit of off-camber corners, which is they're very technical and difficult to drive. Um, that should make it interesting as well for a driver point of view. After that, you get the airpin before the, the, the straight, the main straight line. So I think this will be a spot for overtaking. After that you have what I think would be one of the most technical part of the track, um, a right air pin uh, that kind of opens up on the, on the exit, it's in two parts and then builds in into, into a strange building into a, a second air pin, um, again very technical to get the right line and everything there and then on the exit of that you build in into that long right hander and I think this, this would be very interesting. Um, after that you have a little king, um, nice corner, nothing... Uh, <clears throat> Nothing special about that one, but it's, 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 it's a nice corner. Nice corner, maybe an opportunity for overtaking, but again, you gotta watch out, you get a long straight behind, so uh, maybe you're better off waiting, waiting for uh, to place yourself correctly and overtake at, at the first corner. <laughs> 